everyone, it's Amber from The Sensible Mama. Today's video is going to be all about ring slings. One of the most requested videos that I get from people here on YouTube and also on my chat page on Facebook is what is my favorite kind of ring sling and why? And that's really hard for me to answer because I actually have a ton of different brands that I love a lot. That's actually why I've brought so many different brands to thesensiblemama.com. I want you guys to see and know and love all the brands that I love for baby wearing, so I bring them all to my shop so you can check them out. But I also understand that sometimes you kind of need to know the look and the feel and the length of a sling to pick out what kind of matches best with your own personal preferences. So I thought today I would go through my favorite ring slings and tell you why I love them, what I think are the best features of them, as well as what I think are the features that you might not like if you have one particular preference over another. So I'm going to be going over four brands that I carry at thesensiblemama.com and one that I don't carry but that I highly recommend and I think you would love. I'm going to start with the four that I carry at my store and that is Lilla Baby, Soul Slings, Lenny Lamb, and Techni Wovens. And I'm going to wrap up by talking about the one that I don't carry which is Sakura Bloom. There are going to be um, timestamps, clickable timestamps down in the description box of this video um, and that will link you directly to the description of each particular brand. So if you don't want to watch the entire comparison video, you just want to go straight to Lenny Lamb or uh, Soul Slings, you can just go click on the clickable link down below and it'll take you right there. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get started. The first one that I want to talk to you about is the Lilla Baby Ring Sling. I want to start with this one because I think Lilla Baby is probably the brand that most of my customers and followers are most familiar with. The Lilla Baby Ring Sling retails for $97, which is quite a bit lower than some of the premium ring slings and wraps out there, so it's a really great price point. And what I love about the Lilla Baby Sling is it is just so elegant. This one that I have here is in a print called Magic. It is just solid black with gold rings. If gold is not your preference, they do have other prints that have silver rings instead of gold, but I happen to be a huge gold fan. I feel like Cleopatra when I have this on, so this one's definitely my favorite for sure. The Lilla Baby Ring Sling is made of premium linen, 100% linen. Um, I will say that uh, compared to all of the other ring slings that I have, this one is definitely not as soft as some of the other ones. It's not as strong stretchy either. It's a little bit more of a firm kind of linen, which you might prefer. I tend to like a little bit of a stretchier ring sling, but that's because I've been wearing for a long time and I just kind of am more comfortable with that stretchy feeling. But if you're a beginner and you're just starting out with wearing, especially in a ring sling, you're going to love the Lilla Baby because it doesn't stretch, it is nice and tight, and you feel like there's no slippage or anything once you get this tightened. The Lilla Baby ring sling does have a gathered shoulder as compared to a pleated shoulder. Every ring sling that I carry at thesensiblemama.com is a gathered shoulder just because I think that it is more comfortable and most of my customers tend to prefer it. So I tend to not bring brands on that don't have a gathered shoulder ring sling because I just feel that the gathered shoulder is better. Another thing that you might like about the Lilla Baby ring sling is that it's quite a bit shorter than other ring slings out there. Um, they have a one size fits most approach so they don't have different sizes for this. The other feature of the Lilla Baby ring sling that is kind of unique to Lilla Baby is that it comes with this zippered pouch that actually slips right over the rings. So you can actually put this on if you want to pack up maybe some credit cards or a debit card, your car key, and maybe some lip gloss or something. You can also fit a pacifier or a teething necklace in here. This is not big enough to hold an iPhone, so it's not like a great slot for putting your phone. But if you're the kind of person who likes to just run into the grocery store really fast and you want to wear your baby and just have the things that you need for running into the store, this is a great little thing to have with you and just slip it right over the rings and you have everything that you need right there. The next sling that I want to talk about is the Soul Slings Ring Sling. The Soul Slings line is by far the most affordable one that I have at the shop and really I think just in general it's just a very very affordable brand. Their ring slings range in price from about $28 all the way up to close to $50 depending on the fabric and the weave. The Soul Slings Ring Slings do have sizes so you can get um, any size that you want. It's all listed out on their website. I tend to order size 3 just because that's the most universal size. It kind of fits everything. 
everybody. And I like that the size three leaves a kind of long tail that hangs down about to my hip. So right now, all the slings that we have at thesensiblemama.com are size three, but I am gonna be ordering some of the different sizes to expand that horizon a little bit so that people who like shorter or longer slings can get those as well. What I love about the Soul Slings ring sling is that it is very soft. It's definitely not the softest of the ones that I carry, but it is much, much softer than the Lilla Baby sling for sure. A lot of their slings are dual sided, which means you get a print on one side and then you get the contrasting colors on the other. So that actually when you wear the sling, you get this really cool effect where here you see the black and red going across my chest and then the red and black hanging down on the tail. I just think it's such a nice touch. Um, I get compliments on this ring sling everywhere I go because of that great contrasting pop of color. The Soul Slings ring sling is very, very grippy, which I think is fantastic. Once I get this thing on, I don't get any slipping here by the rings. It tends to stay up on my shoulder really well, which not all slings do. Um, and I never get that feeling that my son is starting to slip or that it's pulling back out through the rings, which is really great. This material is a little bit stretchy. As you can see, I can take it and I can pull it out a little bit, which I like. It's definitely, like I said, um, not the stretchiest or the softest of the fabrics that I have at thesensiblemama.com. So I think that if you are a beginner, you're gonna really prefer kind of this tighter material just because it gives you that little bit of extra comfort. If you're anyone who's doubting like, oh my gosh, is my baby gonna fall out? You're gonna love the tougher kind of fabrics like this one. They're just really tight and secure and don't give when you put your baby in them. The next sling that I wanna talk about is the Lenny Lamb ring sling. And you guys, this is by far the softest, most comfortable ring sling that we have in stock. These can range in price all the way from about $40 up to close to $100 or a little bit more, depending again on the print, the fabric, and the weave of the sling. The Lenny Lamb ring slings are all one size. They are 2.1 meters. If you are in the United States and not super familiar with the metric system, that means that this is about seven feet long. It's like 6.8, I had to look that up. Um, so this is a very lengthy sling. As you can see, I have just got so much tail here. This hangs down almost down to my knee and I'm five foot five. I love a long tail, like I'm not gonna lie, when I'm in a ring sling, I like to have that kind of bohemian, earthy look, and I love this tail just kind of flowing down. I also love that I can pull it up and put it over my baby's shoulder. Um, this is something that I did back when I was breastfeeding, as well as in the cold, windy months when there's a big gust of wind, I'll just pick this up and put it over my shoulder and cover up my baby's face and head which is fantastic, but if you don't like a, a long ring sling, you're probably not going to love Lenny Lamb because it is lengthy and it doesn't have size options. It is one of the slings that it just comes right out of the packaging very soft, but they do recommend that you wash it relatively soon after getting it just to really get that nice, soft, stretchy feel in the fabric. This is a stretchier sling, and I, I don't want to confuse anybody. This is not stretchy the way that a stretchy wrap would be, like a Moby or a Boba wrap. It still is nice and taut. You can see that this is not stretchy stretching very far, but it does have some give to it. Um, and as a more experienced baby wearer than I was a few years ago, um, I like the stretchy feeling just because I feel like it makes more of a hammock for my son. It's more comfortable for him, I think, and it's more comfortable for me as well. Lenny Lamb probably has like the biggest collection of prints I have ever seen. It is impossible for me to carry every one of their prints in my store, though I'm trying really hard to. <laughs> um, and they're always coming out with new prints, sometimes exclusive prints, which is really exciting because you can try to be one of the few to score one of those prints when there's a release, which if you're into Jujube, you, you love that kind of thing. This is a very, very grippy material. I've never had any problems with slippage or feeling like my son was slipping out, which of course, that's gonna be the most important thing to any parent who's trying to baby wear. In fact, this one, i um, never been able to get my husband to enjoy wearing a ring sling, but I actually put him in this one the other day with my son and he was obsessed and he told me, I don't wanna use a full buckle carrier anymore, I just wanna use a ring sling. So that was a pretty powerful effect by the Lenny Lamb ring sling for sure. So again, um, if you like a long tail and if you're the kind of baby wearer who doesn't mind a little bit of stretch in the fabric, you're going to love Lenny Lamb. 
If you're looking for a shorter ring sling, then I would suggest going with um, Soul Slings or Lilla Baby, which have the shorter slings. The last brand from my store that I wanna talk about is the brand called Techni Wovens. And this, you guys, is my favorite brand of ring sling, which really surprises me because I had not heard of Techni Wovens until I met the owner at MommyCon this year. All of Techni Wovens ring slings are wrap conversions. So these were made with wrap material and then were turned into a ring sling. They all have the gathered shoulder. Um, and as far, I think that they are all the same length, but I'm gonna have to look at that. I've only ordered one length. Um, which is about the same length as the sole slings, um, size three. So I'm thinking these are probably closest to a size three sling. The Techni ring slings are definitely the most expensive ones that we carry. They are about 135-ish um, retail, which I know is not the best price point for a lot of people, especially if you're just starting. So I definitely recommend the Techni ring sling to be the kind of thing that you give as a gift to yourself. Maybe starting out with some of the less expensive ring slings first to make sure that you enjoy it. And then when you really know that you and baby are comfortable doing the baby wearing thing, especially in a ring sling, then give yourself the gift of a Techni because they are really, really fantastic wraps, but that price point is like, a little hard to swallow. I will say that I believe the price point is totally worth it. This is a mama owned company that's based here in the United States. There's just a certain level of care that you see in each of these slings. You can tell that these are not mass produced because they're not. Um, and it just, it shows in the quality that you get for sure. The Techni slings, a lot of them are a lot like the Soul slings, slings in that you get a double sided one. So here you can see I have a multicolor print that goes across my chest. And then after I thread this through the rings, I actually have a more uh, whitish monochromatic look on the other side, which looks really cool when I have it laying flat and my baby is in it. I do think that the padding on the Techni sling is the most comfortable. There's just a lot more padding and just security in there that really keeps the rings from digging in. And it's just, it's comfortable all the way from the front of the shoulder to the back, which is great. Techni woven slings do come in what is called loom state. And that means you do need to wash them as soon as you get them. So you don't wanna wear them a couple times and then wash them. You wanna wash them right away because that's what really makes the fabric nice and grippy and soft and just fantastic. The last brand of ring sling that I want to talk about is the Secura Bloom ring sling. This is the brand that I don't carry in the store, but I still highly recommend. Don't let the looks of this sling fool you. This was the second ring sling that I ever bought. The first one didn't work out and I bought this one next and I've had it for almost two years and I have not been good to this thing. I've thrown it in my car, I've washed it not the right way <laughs> and so it's looking pretty well loved but it was gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous when I first got it. The Secura Bloom ring slings are very expensive. They're probably the most expensive on the market. Um, but I do think that they are worth the money. As you can see, the tail is really short on the Secura Bloom ring slings. These are short slings, so if you're not a fan of a long tail, you will definitely like Secura Bloom for sure. Now, what I will say about Secura Bloom is that this particular ring sling is a silk sling, and I don't think I will ever be purchasing a silk sling again. Not only is the silk not as breathable as cotton or linen, so you get hot in it a lot faster, but it also shows wear a lot faster. It doesn't stay as nice and pretty. So if I ever order another Secura Bloom, which I'm sure I will, it's gonna be a linen or a cotton blend um, instead of this silk. The other thing about the silk is that it's not as grippy, so I do find that this tends to slip out. I'm constantly kind of having to lift my son up and tighten the rails a little bit so that he stays in. But again, that is because of the silk fabric, not because of Secura Bloom. This is another one of those brands that you want to give to yourself as a gift after you know that you love baby wearing. It's such a high price point that it's just not going to be something that you want to buy when you're first deciding if you like baby wearing because that's a lot of money. But if you're looking for a super elegant uh, ring sling that you can wear if you're trying to look really nice and sophisticated, Secura Bloom is a great one for that because every one of them is just a very, very beautiful elegant design. So guys, that's it for today's video. I hope that you found this helpful and that it gave you an idea of what kind of ring sling you might be in the market for. Like I said, I have linked all of these slings down in the description box below so that if you're shopping, you can just click on the links and find exactly where to go to get them. Of course, I would love if you would consider shopping with us at thesensiblemama.com. We have free shipping on orders $50 or more and $5 flat rate shipping for orders less than $50. And we have a really generous loyalty rewards point program so that you can earn money while you spend money, which 
who doesn't love that? If you have any questions, please leave them in the description box below. And as always, I will see you next time. Bye-bye.